What's up guys, Zaster here, aka Logging, because I did change my name, and so I recorded this video two different times. First time I didn't have the mic set up, second time I didn't choose the right mic, so it sounds really echoey, and so now this should be on the right mic settings. But yeah guys, uh, I'm going to show you how to change your crosshair in Minecraft, right now I don't like mine. Uh, I, I just now like changed it, and I don't really like it, so I'm going to change it back, I'm going to show you how to. So what you want to do is go to options, resource packs, open resource pack folder, and then you want to choose the resource pack that you want to change. I'm on HCF one, so I'm going to click on that. Uh, close it to Minecraft because you're going to have to do that. And go to assets, Minecraft, textures, and GUI, and then go to icons and drag it onto your desktop. So here we go, just drag it on. And keep this window open right here because you're going to go back to it later. And so yeah, so we got icons right here, right click it, uh, open with, and will Photoshop show up? Let me see. No, Photoshop is not coming up for some reason. Drop open, Adobe. If you guys don't have Photoshop, you can buy it or you can get it cracked. Do whatever you want to do. And so you're going to file, open, click on desktop, and find the icons.png file. There it is. And to scroll in, if you don't know how to use Adobe, I'll, I'll hurry up and show you to scroll and press the control button and the plus sign on your keyboards right next to the backspace. And so there we go. And so then we can just scroll over now. And where's our horrible cross here? There it is, you. And so what I like to do is make sure I always have the black space. So click on this, make sure it's on a pencil tool. Click on that. And that way you always know where the black is and click on this right here make sure it's on rectangle and there we go press delete on your keyboard delete delete and delete and then press Control D to get rid of that box click on the pencil again and then switch it so let's make a new crosshair for I don't know whatever I'll count this later I think it's like that there we go I'm trying to make it even as possible but I'll, I'll go through it and see if it's even and so yeah there we go and so let's see if this even if this is even two three four five six seven eight two three four five six seven eight and then one two three four five six seven five six seven eight okay one more eight one two three four five six seven eight and then you want to switch it back Make sure it's all nice. Make sure it's all nice and white. And so I'm gonna just add little corners right here. There we go. Oops, I actually messed up right there. It's cool, it's cool. Delete, Control D. And then we're gonna delete right here, all these right here. Delete, oops, I'm dumb. Delete, Control D. And then you want to file, save, X out of this. Remember how you always had this out? Just switch it over. There you go. So I'll bring you back whenever I'm in a single player world. All right, guys. So we're going inside the single player world. And there's the new crosshair. Looking mighty fine. It's a little bit smaller. I'm probably going to make it a little bit bigger. But yeah, it still looks pretty good. And so yeah. Uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I want to hurry up and show you this texture pack. It's a really nice texture pack. If I can get the critical animations. Spawn. We're going to spawn. A, not a, yeah, a guardian. No. Just spawn a villager. Yeah, there's. It doesn't have really good particles. Enchant. But yeah, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.